Okay, so what's up guys, this is Pixel Sammy. So for video editing, there are some complex softwares like Final Cut Pro and Premiere Pro. But if you are just a beginner who just want to make a simple video and not go to that crazy stuff, then you guys can use this particular software called Ease Us. Ease Us Video Editor is a really cool and awesome software for beginner friendly YouTubers, content creators, video editors out there and it can get the job done really well without the a toughness of learning any complex softwares like Final Cut Pro or Premiere Pro or After Effects etc. So the link to this particular product is there in the description below if you guys want to check it out. There is a free trial as well if you guys want to just use it and see your experience with it. So with that being said I am going to just give a quick intro and show the particular features this particular software has. So with that being said drop a like, subscribe to this channel and let's get started. So once you open this particular software, you are going to see that you guys can add media, text, filters, overlays, transitions, elements, royalty free music, etc. And these are real cool things to have for any kind of videos out there and these are really simple to use. So whatever elements or overlays or transitions you want to use, just click on download them so that you guys can just keep them downloaded in your computer. After that what you guys need to do is you guys simply need to import your media into your timeline which is pretty simple to use right. So in order to just import media, you can just go to media and click on import or you can just click on file and click on import and import file or folder. This is the way I like to do it but you guys can just drag and drop it into the timeline panel. So after that just choose your footages which you guys feel like it will import on its own. And then after that go to the media panel which is on the top left hand corner and then drag your footages into the timeline. Just click on them. Just click on them and click on plus. And then you are going to see that the footages are automatically added into the timeline. Super simple, super easy to use and super basic. Nothing too crazy. After that, if I just try to add a transition between these two clips, you know, just download any one of the transitions which you guys feel like and then just go to the transition panel. So once the transition is downloaded, just simply choose between the center of two clips just like the way any transition works and then after that click on the plus button of that particular transition and then after that what you're going to see is the transition is automatically added between the two clips just like this so if i play it back you're going to see the transition already there for example just like this so this is a simple transition which you can use and they already have them inbuilt in their software so you guys don't have to download it from anywhere else. And other than this they also have a really cool selection of royalty free music inbuilt in their software so you guys don't need to do anything else like downloading it from the internet such as a paid product or something you guys can just directly use it from here. So you know to just add a music just go to the music tab download the music and just drag the music into the timeline with the plus button. And then this is the result, this is a simple sample footage with the music and the transition. After that if I just want to say add a few element into the transition such as the countdown panel into the transition then I'm going to just go to the elements panel and just you know choose my position in the playhead where I want to put the element and then just click on the plus button. After that what you want to notice is the element which I want to add into the timeline has been already added. So this is like a sample footage with the transition, with the music and with the countdown. And yes, this is just a sample to show what this particular feature does. Of course, I know that you guys can add a lot more elements, lot more sound effects and lot more other kinds of effects into this particular timeline. But for this particular scenario, I'm going to just show the basics like, you know, transitions, elements and music combined and how it looks like and how easy it is to apply it into your timeline or a beginner youtuber for an instance this particular software is going to help you guys a lot and it is going to help you guys step up your editing game a lot as well so once everything is done it's time to export right so just click on export which is there on the top panel as well there is a direct panel for export you guys don't have to go to file then export or something like that there is a direct panel for exporting so click on export choose your format as you can see there is a bunch of formats but i am going to just choose mp4 because it is a standard format and then just choose your destination wherever you want to save it and yes of course one thing i forgot that you guys can change the output settings to 1080p in my case i have just kept it at default which was 720p but of course but in your case you guys can absolutely export it at 1080p as well so after that just click on export and then it will be exported and then your video file is ready to be used and shared in any of your social media or youtube or any other place 
So the download link to this particular product is there in the description below. There's a free trial and the paid version to this. $30 for one year, I don't think it is much for, you know, if you guys want to take this seriously. And it is the super basic software. So it is super simple to use, even if you don't know how to edit your videos. So with that being said, this is Pixel Sammy. We'll be back with another video soon. I hope you guys like this particular video. Peace out.